One minute story. Africa's last glaciers. If this is your first time here though, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below and give me a thumbs up. Start. The glaciers are melting. All of them. Everywhere. They have been for years, but the process has accelerated alarmingly in recent decades. The great ice sheets of Greenland and Antarctica are shedding ice at an ever-increasing rate, shrinking visibly year by year. The world's mountain glaciers are in retreat, their snows and ice fields reduced to a shadow of their former selves. The United Nations Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, IPCC, says that the loss of glaciers is very likely to continue and will accelerate, regardless of any mitigation measures that might be taken to reduce emissions of greenhouse gases. In its latest report, the IPCC says that by the end of the century, the loss of glaciers could contribute to global sea level rise by as much as a meter. This may not sound like much, but it would have a profound impact on coastal communities around the world. A one-meter rise in sea level would flooding vast areas of land and displace tens of millions of people. The melting of glaciers also has another, more immediate, impact, the loss of freshwater resources in areas that are reliant on them. In Europe, for example, Mountain glaciers provide water for drinking, irrigation, and hydroelectric power. The meltwater from glaciers also helps to regulate river flows and mitigate the effects of drought. As the glaciers disappear, so too does this vital water resource. The Alps, the Andes, the Himalayas, all are feeling the effects of climate change, and the glaciers that have sustained local communities for centuries are retreating. It is not just the world's mountains that are affected. Low-lying island nations such as the Maldives and the Marshall Islands are also at risk from rising sea levels. The melting of the world's glaciers is one of the most visible and tangible impacts of climate change. It is happening now, and it is happening faster than anyone anticipated. The loss of glaciers is a tragedy, not just for the people who live in their shadow, but for the entire planet. And Thank you so much for listening. If you're new here, don't forget to click wherever the red subscribe button is. Click that and give me a thumbs up.